So are we are, is there going to be some dog finding mechanics? Unfortunately, no. Oh, so that's just a one-off story about a missing dog? Yeah, uh, the there's a few manuscript now. pages it's that you can only get the on uh, the higher difficulty uh, nightmare mode. Mm -hmm. um, oh, oh, and, one of, and one of those I've looked up um, has to do with the dog getting like taken by the darkness. Hmm. Oh, the the famous dog. There's still some dogs. <laughs> yes, Carl Stucky um sees fit to rank hot dogs while stalking us. Uh, well, I don't know. That seems it seems of the usual for a game villain to do. Like it's all kind of like stuff he'd be telling like tourists and people want to buy houses. But like, imagine if he was telling people this stuff in like that tone of voice. <laughs> yeah. While, like, chasing them down through the house they're, like, looking at, or, like, while they're, like, checking out the town for the first time, or stuff like that. Well, hey, Mr. Stucky, it's good to meet you. PREMIUM CABINS FOR RENT! You, you're, you're, you legitimately are just, like, walking down the street, and you just hear someone yelling this shit and chasing after you, like, oh, fuck. Oh, it's just Carl Stucky again. There goes the two- the Information guy. Carl Stucky. I don't know, what's, what, more manuscript pages? Mm -hmm. The shotgun is a really good weapon, to be honest. I mean, even, like, some of those shots were kind of long range, and it's it still did the job well. It's a sniper shotgun? Yeah. Why has that never been in Metal Gear? Um, I'll tell you why. Because Metal Gear is for big poo-poo heads. <gasps> you take that back! I will never take that back. Okay, I was actually just thinking, imagine, like, when those two guys are coming at you, this game with, like, Metal Gear Rising mechanics, though. Yeah. Like, yeah, the, I, the flashlight is basically blade mode. That's what I mean. It's the like, same button. It could potentially be the worst game ever made. There's some potential <laughs> there to make the worst thing possible for a human to have to play. I, I'm surprised they didn't go for that. Put in some log lifting mechanics. That's how you'd improve this game, is to make it worse. Why did the light affect that? I don't know, I think that's a scripted thing. Oh, Irregardless okay. of the light. <laughs> He's running away because he heard about salad. <laughs> Carl Stucky needs a hefty meal. <laughs> oh shit. His, the Carl Stucky minions are after you. Shit. That, killed, that's a pretty cool shot. You killed the shit out of that boy. I forgot to mention when he was talking about hot dogs that he ranked Belly Burster second best, and that is kind of an uncomfortable name for a hot dog. Honestly. Yeah, it kind of is, but I can understand why it'd be second best to the famous one. To the famous yeah. dog. Pick up another shotgun. Okay, um... Shoot the TV. Do you like the Twilight Zone? Um, what is the Twilight Zone? Just kidding, of course. Okay, well, have fun not liking this TV show. Okay. Oh, oh. Night Springs. Yes, they have their own... They have their own Twilight Zone slash Scary Door ripoff. <laughs> Holy shit, they went all out on this. I they know, got the, this they got is the intern. Like... Alright, let's videotape the intern. Ladies and gentlemen of the press, I am Dr. Barkley Colvin. Oh, it's the guy from Mythbusters. Looks kind of like him. It's definitely him. Kind of balder. More Cock Institute. Get it? Uh, it's just a little joke. Is this this game's rated T, right? They can't say that. Oh shit, the guy from Mythbusters. Two of them. A real experiment. Known as a quantum suicide. Did he say suicide? Is that a real gun? Night Springs has pretty bad lip sync for a live action show. Um, I'm pretty sure this is by 
far the worst episode of the Twilight Zone I've ever seen. It it gets worse, honestly. You might think this round is merely a dud. Not so. Observe the flower pot. Observe the jump cut. Oh, it's a girl from Twilight or uh, not Twilight Zone, Mythbusters. One in which the weapon didn't fire, and one where it did. With my machine here. <laughs> there's also a reality where this game wasn't made, <laughs> and there's a reality where you were never hired to do this. Quantum immortality. Some call it the perfect reality. Can this gun kill me? So wait, wait, wait. What you're saying is that every time you pull the trigger, in another reality, you die? Yes. <laughs> How did they not lip sync live action? There's an infinite number of things that could happen at any moment, and they always. Okay, this is stupid as all hell. The point is, this one thing did not happen here. Nice music, though. Insane, Colvin. Insane. Insane. Wait. Hey, was this thing supposed to be plugged in? I stumbled on it. You fools! Gaze upon quantum immortality. Are you fucking kidding me? Now, forgive me, but I think the solution to your problem might be don't plug the machine in where some idiot's foot in the audience. Yeah. And make it unplugged. <laughs> A curiosity often kills the cat. No! Wait, is that gonna have anything to do with the rest of this game? Absolutely nothing. Thank god you fucking shot the TV, <laughs> and it did not make a mark on it. Okay, uh, it only has barely a little bit to do with the game. Uh, there's several other Night Springs episodes. The thing oh, is, Alan, Alan uh, used to write for Night Springs, is the thing. The game oh, will okay. reveal later. Oh, he's a garbage writer, then. Yeah, so he is really a piece-of-shit writer. He probably wrote that episode. Well, I'm assuming the implication is that, yeah, like, it's haunting him, I guess? The, the bad writing is haunting me. I don't know. I just, all I did was rip off the Twilight Zone, whoops. So this whole scene I did completely again in order to get a more cinematic, uh, sort of climax to it. Okay. And I think... I think it paid off. I look forward to it. Because there's, there's Stucky right there, the bastard. Yeah. But he is... Since he's a boss character, he gets, uh, more taken powers. He can sort of turn invisible and zip around, like Sonic the Dark Hedgehog. Sonic the Dark Hedgehog? Who is that? I don't know. Is it, I mean, he's fast, but also made of darkness. Oh, okay. That's, his name is Shadow. I, oh. Oh. So Stucky's pretty strong. He can take a bunch of shotgun blasts like that, but... Still not strong enough. It's a lot more impressive looking than my first attempt at it. a lifetime of nightmares to come. So is Stucky dead forever now? Yes. Wait, really? Yeah. Did you actually straight up like take him out of the game? He's dead. Yeah. Oh. Well, I'm kind of bummed out. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. I mean, all you had to do is go to the fucking gas station, Alan. <laughs> Stucky he was I trying to fuck the parade up. float I had seen in Bright Falls when I first arrived with Alice. <laughs> you recognize that uh, parade I, float, huh? I told you this game's this town's deer obsession only goes deeper. <laughs> I r really hope After it perpetuates insanity, like the entire. It's, the it darkness. is the root of this town. The it's the just deer obsession. They love deer moment, so much. The same world reasserted itself. The same world of giant fucking deer. The deer Here we are. had been two weeks away. Oh shit! Arrived. It's coming up. If the day count on the banner was right. I was missing a whole week between the night we got here and now. So yeah, Deerfest is a major plot point. <laughs> Wait, so what's he saying? Did he, like, travel through time? Uh, uh, he's missing a week somehow. He has no memory of the last the week. Was a mess. That's kind of a cool concept. Like trash the place. Yeah. Um, so does the rest of the game of take fight. place after this missing week, or...? Yeah, playing. pretty much. Outside, huh. there's only dark. Are we gonna have to outside watch another one? Outside the story, there's only darkness. I can feel a presence. In oh, the it's dark. him. 
Just now. I can yeah, this isn't Night nice Springs. Room. I'll reach her. I'll this is somehow back. more interesting. The will come true. If I stop, she's lost. I don't believe this. It'd been me on the TV talking crazy. Was I losing my mind? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Problem solved. No more I'm TV. Gonna, I told you, I'm going to try to shoot as many TVs and l rivers as I can. Yeah. <laughs> it's shoot the, shoot the phone? I would have shot the phone. Man. I would have shot the cash register if I had time, but... Alan, you know, you're because down with capitalism. You're going to jail. We all just watched that episode of that show you wrote, and it was pretty bad. You were going. You're to jail. going to jail for being the worst writer in the you world. I'm Alan Wake. But listen, I was in a car crash. My wife Alice, she's missing. Calm down, Mr. Wake. We were staying in a cabin on the island on Cauldron Lake. There's no island on Cauldron Lake. Not since the big eruption in the '70s. Please, I can take you there, okay? You look like you've taken a pretty bad knock to the head. Are you okay? Listen. We'll figure this out. Please get in the car. We'll swing by the lake and then we'll go to the station. Okay? Can Mr. we get Wade, some ice cream too? <laughs> the guy who owns this place? Ice cream would be nice. I realized I couldn't tell her what had happened in the forest. She Did you see Carl me. Stucky? I realized I, I couldn't tell her what happened in the house. forest. Yeah, I shot him. <laughs> Have you he's seen dead. Carl Stucky? Yeah, he's over there and there and a little <laughs> bit over there. He is dead as shit. You're not gonna see him. <laughs> Have you seen Carl Stucky? <laughs> you won't be seeing him anytime soon. <laughs> Have I seen Carl uh, Stucky? <laughs> Let me tell you, I know all about changing a spark plug now, thanks to Carl Stucky, who I totally didn't murder. Is he already in love with her? Oh. So. What the fuck? Where's the island? Alan Wake. Cool. Just in case you forgot what you were playing. I did not realize what game I've been playing. Alan Wake. Hmm. Sounds good. Maybe I'll buy it. Go to sleep. Everything is alright. Well, that guy said everything's alright, so I, th I, I don't think there's really a problem here. <laughs> um, so that that's Alan Wake... Chapter one. Yeah, it's structured six episodes. Uh, struck. They kind of tried to structure it like a thriller TV serial. Yeah. So maybe it worked out. I don't know. Um. Uh oh. What? Uh. What? Okay. Well, are you ready for the real horror? What? I guess he wasn't recording. Are you fucking kidding me? Yes, I am fucking kidding. <laughs> okay, good. Good. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my God. <laughs> Don't. Wow. Uh, I thought I, I just wanted to spook you. I wanted to be a little bit like Alan Wake and just get, pull a little prank and a goof on you. That is scarier than anything in this stupid fucking game. Holy shit. <laughs> um, 